Hello and welcome. We're going to solve this problem together, but first, why don't you pause the video and give it a shot. Okay, so let's read the problem. It says the four tables below show relationships in which x values represent inputs and, and the y values represent the corresponding outputs. So you've got inputs, which are x values. These are x's inputs. And y's, which represent the outputs. And the rule here, they want to know which table is represents a relationship that is not a function. Uh, when you have this question, all you're doing is to figure out um, a function, right? you're looking at them from this perspective. A function essentially is where inputs, inputs have only one output. Right? So there's no, there's no x value that has multiple outputs. Right? Um, let's look at our tables. So here I notice none of the x values even repeat, so we don't even need to consider it, because how could any one of these have more than one output in this table if they only appear once? Once. So what you're doing is you're scanning, you're scanning until you see a repeat input. And you finally see it here, right? So notice that three as an input gets you four, and it also gets you negative four. And there's nothing wrong with that, it's just that's a relationship, but it's not a function. Three as an input can only lead to one output. It can't lead to both four and negative four. So that means our answer is T. All right, I hope this helps.